So from down last night, I locked my keys in the truck. Didn't even remember that I put them in there. Well, I remember that, oh well, hey, I'm gonna take this with me. And I was thinking I have my keys on me. When actually I put them in the side cubby in the passenger door, thinking I'm just gonna leave them here and sit on in case I don't drop them or lose them. So, the whole time I'm fishing, I'm thinking my keys are in my pocket. And they're not. It's like, are you kidding me? You notice me standing in the middle of the dock. But I just get paranoid when my I'm above water and I got my phone out, or when I'm by water and my phone's out. Especially when it, the way it's hooked up like this, where it can just fall off, and not you know from my hand. You know, some people when they go next to water, their hand with something in it, their phone, they'll more likely put it away from the water as far as possible. Yeah, that's me. Unless I know it's in a zipper or something. I'm gonna take that uh, that swim bait off with a spinner. Sunfish down there. So I got the eye gogs for fishing, the polarized. I like them so far. I haven't used them in years. Never like really like worn or wearing glasses. I stopped wearing hats for a while, then I started to get back into wearing hats. I'm just going around the lake once. Now I'm going back home. I'm glad I found my keys. Whew. That was scary.
And he pulled one of my pieces of skirt off. Right now I can feel the paint working a lot better. Nice sunnies down there. Spinner bait. Huh, that's weird. Now when it comes at you, it looks like it just spins like this. Like it's tangled up. But it sets its blades to keep going, the whole board just spins. Like it's got twisted too much. That's how it looks. something for a second. My nephew's asking why you slap the water with the with your lure? Like you're mad at it or something. Just to help get all that slime out, you don't gotta touch it. I wonder what time it is. said there ain't much current down here I see a bass sitting right in there Catch him with the Ned rig. That's what I think. If I catch him with the Ned rig, let's see about catching him with Gary rig.
I just wait till I kind of got over the bridge. I don't want my phone falling in. <laughs> I think I was saying last night, the night before. That, uh, you have like a little clip right here. You can pull it out and it actually secured your phone into your chest mount a lot better. If you have already done that, let me know. I'm tired. Couldn't really sleep with crap. I don't know what the heck of the heck of what my key is then. Cause I walked all this back last night, I'm like, okay. I only sat down here, sat down here, pulling cords out of my pocket, but never my, my keychain. So I got those up around my neck right now. Yep. Make sure I ain't dropping them or we're gonna lose these. Texas Velcro and I put it on there just uh, when I put up against inside my little base I got my body strap around me so I wedge my butt in into my side but then I'll move back and forth that's why I did that that Velcro here and then just strap it off to your your armpit strap I'll keep it in one one spot. Maybe just keep going. You don't got to take your backpack off, put it back on, or anything. Thank you guys for joining, subscribing, and liking the videos. I appreciate it very much. I don't know, the one video I got like 300 and some views. Dang. I wasn't expecting to get that much. And that was on the 29 fish. The counting video. Uh, what should I call this video? Turn of nothing, fish, and keys found, or keys found, but nothing hot. I'm hungry. All these glasses worked out pretty good today. The only thing I was going to have them on, put your hat on, they come up off your nose. Hit that, like push it off your nose, and you gotta try to push it down on your nose. Okay, get the 
keys out. There we go. Glasses off. I'm on top of the hood. So that way. I know where they're at. at an angle if I had the ass of my like that have my ass end of my rods behind me so now I can face it that way since I got nobody sitting or jet rides passenger with me. It was pretty much just myself. But yeah, put them right behind you, face it off to the side and you're good to go. You know, if you put, people think, well, if I put them behind the driver's side, passenger side, they're just going to hang over the front of the passenger side. But, if you got bungee cords up there, they move. That's great. Ah, uh, what next? 